Good morning, everyone. It is Friday morning, and I'm starting the vlog off in bed with Snooki again. Um, <sighs> Snooki's hair is really bad today. She, I noticed yesterday, um, it was getting a little bit snarly on top. And I really haven't had time to pay attention to her um, this past week with the funeral and everything. It was just a really, really busy week. And with me going back to work and stuff, it was just really hectic. But today I plan on, um, you know, just kind of doing some odds and ends. I took off work today. So um, I plan on running some errands with my mom um, and being with her. I plan on going to the Yankee Candle Outlet Store today, so I'm hoping to get some footage for you guys there. And brushing out the dog for sure. Snooky, let me, Snooky, let me see your hair. Look at how bad it is. It's like a rat's nest on the top of her head. But that's her fault. That is, well, it's my fault too for not brushing it out every day. But um, she, she literally, every single time I do her hair, She'll rub her head, like, right in, he in here on anything she can find and snarl it up again. She's just like that. But So here is the start to our weekend. Right, Snooky? Oh, my feeties are cold. Doing daily Snooky duties. Gonna go potties? Go potties. <clears throat> Good girl. Oh my god, her hair. Good girl. <laughs> so for today's melts, I'm going with Better Homes and Gardens. The first one I'm going to do is Country Fall Festival. And then the second one I'm going to do is Fresh Pumpkin Rolls. I thought these two would kind of go well together. I'm putting the six cubes of the Country Fall Festival in my big warmer. And it just kind of smells kind of like a country farmer's market. Um... If you can imagine what that smells like and then the fresh pumpkin rolls that just smells basically really really spicy pumpkin with bakery added to it so that's what I'm gonna do for my living room today and for coffee Friday I picked um, by Archer Farms pumpkin pie it just says Flavors of spice, pecans, caramel, and brown sugar. And this is also a light uh, roast coffee. I'm pairing it up with French Vanilla Sugar Free by International Delight. Um, this coffee is awesome. It's like roasted pecans is basically what it tastes like. And it's just like one of the best coffees I've ever had. Like I said, the Archer Farms from Target is just phenomenal. I highly suggest you guys going and picking some of this stuff up. Uh, you coffee lovers out there, you will not be disappointed. So let's get started. editing videos today. It's like 11 o'clock in the afternoon. I'm still in my pajamas. I haven't showered. I haven't done anything and I don't care. Have you guys ever had one of those days where you just haven't like done anything and you just kind of want to relax? I mean, it's my day off and I don't feel like doing anything today, but I'm going to go to the Dollar Tree 
and the bank I want to pick up some stuff because I took down all of my fall like decor items even though it's only the 15th of November and I know we still have Thanksgiving and I know I'm kind of rushing it but I just wanted to take like everything down and get some Christmas stuff up because I can remember last year I put the Christmas stuff up the day after Thanksgiving and I feel like I have you know a lot of Christmas stuff so I set everything up got everything all set ready to go and it was like less than 30 days later I was taking everything down again so it was kind of like I kind of want more Christmas I like Christmas better than I do Thanksgiving so I kind of like skip over Thanksgiving and then just go right to Christmas but oh my lunch is ready potatoes and cheese so yeah, I'm cooking potatoes and cheese. As you can see, it's really, really hot. The steam is like coming off of it. But this is just a lean cuisine. It's 220 calories. And then I also have, if you can see beyond the steam, um, a honey crisp apple. I still have, let me look and see how many honey crisp apples I have in my bag. I still have three left. Um, this is from the farmer's market or I'm sorry, this is from Little Farmer, and I paid um, $9, if you can see. Oh, where is it? There we go. $9 for Honeycrisp half of peck. So that's not too bad. Um, I love Honeycrisp apples. If you guys haven't tried them yet, go ahead and go to your grocery store and look and see. They're probably all gone at this point, but I think they do have them at Whole Foods Supermarket. So try to go check them out. Well, here we are at the bank again, and of course, I chose the wrong lane. I don't know why I do that every single time. I guess because I feel like my van is going to um, knock into those things, so I always just basically choose the one closest um, to the teller, but so I have to, like I said previously, do this, and then I'm going to go to the dollar store. And I have to remember to get toothpaste. I ran out of toothpaste. And I don't know if you guys know this or not, but like the dollar store has a lot of items for cheaper name brand stuff um, compared to like Walmart. Not that I'm like really into saving on money and stuff, but it's just something to ponder. So I'm in the car now uh, on my way to go shopping. And it was so funny because, okay, so I was making a deposit at the bank, and this always happens to me, like, at really odd times when I'm not expecting it, but the bank teller was like, oh, she's like, I don't know if this cent is on your money or not, but it must have come from your house, but it smells so good. And I'm like, oh, I'm like, is it is it kind of like a potpourri type scent or something like that? And she's like, yes, mixed with chocolate. And I'm like, oh my God, that's my Yankee candles. I'm like, I'm like a candle whore and I have a whole bunch of candles at my house and stuff. And she's like, oh yeah, she's like, that's what it smells like. She's like, or it smells like you came from like a boutique up north. And I'm like, yeah, that's what a lot of people say. So um, it gets like on your clothes and apparently it gets on your money as well, which I find so hilarious, but oh my gosh. So, oh, I'm like tired. I'm just getting back into eating correctly again. As you guys know, with all the stress going on and everything like that, I haven't really been um, watching what I eat and I've been really trying to and um, I think that that contributes to like not eating healthy I think that contributes to me being tired all the time and stuff um, I think it has a lot to do with your energy level your metabolism obviously everything but um yeah, and I curled my hair before I left here. This is third day non-wash, and my hair curled so tightly. I'm a little bit, like, worried about it. I don't know if I look like Shirley Temple or what, but my hair kind of, like, curled and coiled, 
and I hate that like when you feel like you're gonna have a good hair day and then all of a sudden it like turns to shit and like you can't I didn't have time to get back you know in the shower and actually wash it so it is what it is damn roundabouts again oh I hate it because I never know when to go and it's like a race to go and it's just I feel like I'm gonna hit somebody oh they're all over in our city I hate it oh my god I gotta get in the other lane oh. Goodness gracious. I guess we were the first city in our area to get all these roundabouts yeah you better stop mister and um now like a whole bunch of surrounding areas are actually getting the roundabouts as well. Okay, are you gonna turn or are we thinking or what's going on? Notice I like to chat at other people as I'm driving. Oh. So this is the Dollar Tree, as you guys can see. Let me get a parking spot. It's right next to Festival Foods, which I absolutely love. They're like my faves to grocery shop at because they've got such a good deli department so let's see what we can find at the Dollar Tree So this is what I picked up at the Dollar Tree. As you can see, this is one of my Yankee Candle warmers, or not warmers, um, stands, candle holders. And then I basically, what I did is I just picked up this um, Christmas kind of pine garland. And this came, it was 15 feet, but I just kind of like wrapped it around. And then I picked up these bell garlands and this present garland, and I just kind of wrapped it around there. Of course, it's shedding a little bit right now, but um, yeah, so I thought that that would be cute for my Yankee candles. And then I picked up these flowers also in the back at the dollar store. I mean, really, really cheap, inexpensive idea for you guys to, you know, make little tiny projects. And then I need more pebbles in here, but I picked up these green pebbles. Um, and then also the glass jar came at the Dollar Tree too. So got a really good deal, I think. I think everything came to like 10 bucks. Not bad at all for like little, you know, decor type thing that's like really inexpensive. God, look at my hair. I look like one of these women, like, I don't know. It's a mess. A mess. But anyway, um, oh, I'm headed to Yankee Candle, uh, the friends and family sale with my mom. I'm super excited. I don't know what I'm going to get. There was one scent there that I really, really wanted, and I can't remember the name of it, and they had it, so she put it away for me. Um, I'm just going to go to the outlet, but there's Snooky Louise. She's not going. But anyway, um, I'm hoping to find um, some scents that I've never smelled before. Hopefully, maybe, I don't know. And then um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to vlog in the store. Probably not. I may show you guys some of the candles. I don't know. If they're super busy, though, I'm not going to record at all. But I'll show you guys, you know, what I got a little, like, sneak peek before I do my haul video, which um, I'll probably post at a later date. But I'll let you guys know what I got. But other than that, Snooky Louise is looking.
guys. So we are at Red Robin right now. This is my very first time um, being at Red Robin. And we just got back from Yankee Candle. We got tons of deals. Um, I'll show you guys in a little bit what we all got or I'll show you tomorrow just because it's it's dark out and stuff. But um, yeah, this is a pretty nice place. Like I said, I've never been here before and we ordered the burger. We're gonna split it. I thought a little bit of red meat isn't gonna kill me but um, yeah so I'll show you guys when it comes pretzel bites with beer battered cheese oh my lord and we just picked up some fries I split a burger with my mom just because I didn't feel like I needed the whole burger so it was less calories so we are back from Yankee and as promised, I told you guys that I was gonna show you what I got. I got this lid for my candle. It's got um, a snowman and a different, or a whole bunch of different, you know, trees on there also. We'll just like slowly turn it around and then a snowman on the other side. I think it is so pretty. I absolutely love it. So I got that. And then I also got these candles. I'm going to be doing a Yankee Candle haul um, that I'll show you guys a little bit more in depth. But I got a large jar in cherry ice, which smells really, really similar to cherries on snow. So that's why I got it. I also got this one. This one is Frosted Cedar Wreath. And it smells like a Christmas tree wreath with... Um, peppermint in it also it smells so good and then i got this this is a medium size pure radiance uh crackling and i got it in merry mint if they had any large ones in this one i would have grabbed it immediately because this one smells so good and then this is a new one that they just got in. It's actually brand new for the spring. It's called, and excuse the way I pronounce this, Champaka Blossom. Not real sure, but it's really, really pretty and it smells gorgeous. And then I got Lakeside Birch which is um, another one that I've wanted to get for a really long time. And then I just got Snowberry, and um, I saw a lot of people haul Snowberry before, so I thought that that would be a good one to also have for the holiday season. But I think I'm going to hit the hay. It's been a, long, been a long day, and I'm just going to hit the hay, and hopefully um, I will have more footage for you guys tomorrow. I'm sorry I didn't get that much footage at Yankee Candle. I wish I would have gotten more, but they were super busy and we bought a lot. My mom saved over $200. She got so many candles and so much, um, so many like decorator decorative things that I just, I had to get out of there. It was just way too much for me to handle, but I will see you guys. Um, and talk to you Saturday morning. Good night. Good morning, everybody, and happy Saturday. Today for my melts uh, is going to be a busy day. I'm going to be using uh, Busy Tarts birthday cake, which looks like this. And then I'm going to be using Busy Tarts pumpkin spice latte, which looks like this. And I just have that one in my a large warmer and then this one in the my living room I'm melting moon pie and I'm melting salted caramel and these are both from Yankee Candle hey guys so I'm getting ready to go to the PAC which is the Performing Arts Center and I'm gonna go see Footloose I've been excited to see this for quite some time um, so I'm just getting ready and my mom is going to pick me up. It looks so dreary outside. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. It looks really gross. But anyway, um, so I am pissed off at my kids. Somebody took my straightener. I don't know who it was. I have looked through this house high and low for my straightener and I cannot find it. And which is why my hair is back in a ponytail with my bangs to the side because I wanted to wear my hair down today and obviously I can't, <coughs> excuse me. So 
Also, I got all of my Christmas decorations out um, with the exception of the tree. I need help with that, so I'm going to wait for my daughter to get home from work uh, with that. But every single year after I get my Christmas decorations out and, you know, set up and everything, I always get really wheezy, and I feel like it's because of probably, like, the dust, and I store it in my like back 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 closet in all these boxes and stuff and when I open them up I just I breathe all that stuff in so I'm hoping that my asthma isn't starting to flare up but this is the time of year it is the season but I don't think I'm well I know for a fact that I'm not going to be able to vlog any uh footloose or not footloose I keep on calling it footloose um I'm not going to be able to vlog any of the performing arts center um, because they don't allow cameras in there. So flash dance, not footloose. Um, so I'm going to have to just take it all in myself and you guys are going to have to just imagine being there with me. Uh, but if I can film, I will, but probably not because they don't allow cameras. So, um, and hopefully it doesn't rain really bad. It looks like, it looks like it's gonna. Look at this sweet little angel. Oh, pumpkin. She's just been so sweet and lovey today. Probably because I moved all of her toys and her bed um, out of the way in the living room because of the Christmas decorations. So she knows something's going on, but she's not real sure what it is. Huh, Snooky? You know something's going on. What's going on? What's going on? Did mama move your toys? And your bed? raining it's pouring the old man is snoring it's like raining 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 it's going to be raining here all day on sunday uh we're actually supposed to have tornado weather which is kind of scary for the month of november we're in mid-november today's the 17th and uh yeah i plan on going to tj maxx today so hopefully it's not raining too hard because I have some errands to run. Today for my melt, I'm going to be using Daphne's Pumpkin Frosting Cornucopia. And this is like a huge, I don't know if you want to call it like a huge donut or a huge cookie. Let me just get it out. I think it's probably a cookie. Hold on a second. Looks like this, and I'm using the whole thing. Um, I know it's pretty big, but it smells delicious, and I'm just going to put it in my big warmer and melt it all day. And then I also have from Nikki's Wax uh, Monster Amish Bread, so I'm going to put those, probably just two, not three. So I think three, well, no, three. I'll put three in my smaller warmer. So that's what I'm melting today in the living room. Hey everyone, so I'm getting ready to go to TJ Maxx and it is like thundering and lightning outside, which is crazy to me. Um, what if this was all snow? We'd have a huge storm. But anyway, I'm gonna try to get footage at TJ Maxx and then my mom needs to stop at Yonkers. I'm not gonna go in because otherwise we would be there forever. Um, so yeah, thank God I have an umbrella.
And now let's go to Walmart. The windows are all fogged up because it's raining outside and it's hot outside. My car says that it's 55 degrees, which in November is pretty warm. Um, they've had like tornado uh, warnings and stuff like that, but I just got back in the car from Walmart. I didn't find any de Christmas decorative pillows though, so I'm not real sure where I'm going to go. Um, I may have to go to like a Pier 1 Imports or something like that. I'm really surprised though that TJ Maxx didn't have them. But anyway, watch for my hauls um, if I don't post them already before this video goes up. But um, now I'm going to go home, I'm going to make some chili, and sit down and watch the Packers game. I think they play the Giants, not too sure, but I know that they play at 3.30, so I really hope they win because they've been doing kind of lousy with injuries. Hi everybody, so I'm going to be ending the vlog. It is uh, Sunday night, the Packers are losing big time, and it's depressing, but um yeah, I had a really, really busy weekend. I'm glad you guys could all join me. Please don't forget to thumbs up this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Remember, I do vlogs uh, every weekend, so you guys will be able to view more. Um, I do candle reviews and everything. I do a health uh, video, kind of health check type thing every Sunday. So make sure and tune in for that. And thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe. And if you have any questions, please list them down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.